Good morning, I'm Captain Brian Weiss. I'm the commanding officer of Naval Air Station Jacksonville here in Northeast Florida. We sustain, enable, and support the warfighter. That's really the core mission. We've got 110 tenant commands, all different aspects, but first and foremost, we're a Naval Air Station, so what we do is support aviation. And the aircraft that you see back here are part of the P-8 fleet. It's the newest maritime patrol and reconnaissance aircraft. We've got Fleet Readiness Center Southeast, and they're Northeast Florida's largest industrial maintenance facility. We also have a hospital on board this base. We've got helicopter squadrons that fly the MH-60. We've also got over 100 years of history that is special to NAS Jacks. So the importance of having a, a Naval Air Station in a good location is you do a lot of training here before you go out and, and execute the mission. So Florida is an ideal place. If you look behind me, there's probably not a cloud in sight and that makes for ideal conditions. But for NAS Jacksonville specifically, it's a quick jaunt to get out to uh, what's known as military operating areas. It's just a vast expanse on the east coast of Florida that allows us to, to basically operate uh, wherever we need to operate. And then lastly, we've got a range to the south of here, um, and it's called Pine Castle. It's in the Ocala National Forest, and that is the only live bombing range on the east coast. And that's a pretty special area where folks can get ready and really sharpen that spear before they head out over the horizon. And Florida is the only place that does that. I think Florida's best postured uh, to, to support the mission and I wouldn't want to come anywhere else. This is one of those places where the folks around you love the military, they're very pro-military. You've got the resources here and you've got the weather. That's a dynamite trio.